competitors out there that if you email them with a really good idea, and you might not even have your site up and running yet, but it's a professional, friendly, not stocky email, you just might hear back from that person, whether they link to your site or agree to be interviewed or featured on it. So again, I would just encourage you, as Lockhart said, to make connections even tonight with fellow bloggers. It's, it's probably the best thing that you can do for your website. For a lot of people, we, what you need is you need enough page views, and we could go into the intricacies of how you price this stuff out if that's of interest in the Q&A. But you really, you end up needing enough page views, or you can't really start selling ads at any real volume until you have, you know, a nice big chunk of page views. And it's just so hard on day one, or even on day 30, or even on day 180, to have a whole ton of page views to sell. So. I might suggest really focusing early on on, on editorial and audience growth, um, and then in, you know advertising can start to take care of itself you know a year or so after that. When we first launched the site, we tried to grow really, really, really quickly, and you can kind of get lost in that, and you start to sort of lose some of the soul of the site. And when we take a step back to start thinking, you know, what do people want? I mean, the amazing thing is, is when you ask people, believe it or not, you can actually ask your readers. Uh, what do you want? They'll tell you. So if you get a dedicated audience coming to you, again, it, it, it will happen. I mean, build it and they will come, yeah. Um, but that's why I, I agree, like, really, really need to focus on what your passion points are, who you want as an audience, or, or just what your audience wants, and, and let them speak to you and, and see what resonates, and, and sort of take your time a little bit. We, we sort of forget with the pace of the internet that you know, sometimes you have to sort of stop for a second, think about it, because the internet changes every single day. And you'll find yourselves changing every single day, by the way.